day everyone, my name is Rachel P. Simignano, and I'm a student at Minskat University, Visa Section B, and major in crop science. So let's have a demonstration upon preserving a spider and grasshopper and upon dissecting both of that insects. Before we start, I will consider the materials that I will going to use. Just pour the 70% solution alcohol to the containers and I prepare cottons to pin the insects on it. And now let's have the dissection of the two insects that I have been preserved. So let's start with the grasshopper and next is the spider. The external features of a grasshopper is first the grasshopper's body. So as you can see it is the grasshopper's body. Yes. That's region is the the body of a grasshopper where it is a narrow, elongated, tubular, and somewhat compressed laterally. Second external feature is its body body's color is yellowish and gray, which enables them to resemble the environment in which they live. Third thing is the entire body is covered by a hard cuticle or integument. Cuticle is divided into def definite numbers of segments. It's divided into head, thorax, and abdomen. Let's begin to the head. The head is big and somewhat triangular. Yes, yeah, somewhat triangular. You can see it shaped like a triangle. There is a pair of large compound eyes. Yes, this is the eye. One eye and this is the another eye. And also it includes the mouth. This is the mouth. Surrounding the mouth opening, there are some mouth appendage, appendages. Thorax are having the three pairs of segmented legs. So, it is the first pair, second pair, and the third pair. Unfortunately, uh, the grasshopper lost its third, third pair of legs. And also on the on that region we can see the grasshopper wings. This this is the wing and another wing. The four wings are a bit thicker and hind wings are broad and membranous. And the last thing is the abdomen of a grasshopper, which is elongated and gradually narrowed towards the poster end. Yes, this is the... In this region, this is the abdomen, where the post... It is the posterior end of the abdomen, this. This one is the poster end of the abdomen. Bears a pair outgrowth known as anal cirque. On the two sides of body, eight pairs of respiratory openings called spiracles are present. Yes, it can be seen in the, in the abdomen. On the head region is the antenna. This is the first antenna and this is the second antenna. And it's called antennae. So let's talk about the external feature of a spider. So, it is divided into two sections, the head and the thorax. So, in the head, it is the mouth and it is the eyes. It also includes the fangs or its claws. It has two claws. 
and move on. Let's talk about the thorax. Thorax had uh, four pairs of legs. One, two, three, and four. Four pairs. Overall, it has eight legs. While this is the abdomen. So that's it. That's the external feature of a spider.